Family history often directs family life hell. It's a very important aspect of how we behave as parents in relationship with our children and our spouses. I'm not speaking of pure genetics here. Some people are adopted. I'm speaking of what happened on a one-to-one -one basis to the parent, you, uh, when you were a child, and to the grandparents when they were a child and on and on into history and into infinity. You see, what's happening now is a direct result of what happened in the past. We may be reacting to it in a positive or negative way, and the impact of our history is still the profound driving force of our reality. Let's look at ourselves and assess where we are on the evolutionary scale. And if we're still doing negative knee-jerk reactions to the various situations we have set up with our families, then it's past time to change. Do you object to making lasting improvements, life-changing enhancements, leaps in the thrive factor for yourself and your family? Family life and our individual lives are deeply intertwined. Once you give birth to a human, you are forever changed at the core of who you think you are. You have changed at that moment into a divine caretaker, governor, and inspirer. Your assignment, should you choose to accept it, is to thrive and shine as you have never done before. Hell is a relative place. If I were attempt to run a marathon right now, I would be in hell right along 30 minutes from now. Yet people run marathons, 26 miles and more, every day, somewhere in the world. Parenting is very much the same way. It's a grand, glorious endeavor that we take for granted. The truth is, it is a freaking relationship marathon. Proper training is an excellent idea so that you and your children get the most out of the experience. Otherwise, disaster awaits. Some small disasters, and then others that wear on the very fiber of your nerves for years on end. I'm here for you. Tell me, what questions do you have about getting out of parenting hell?